is the wrong place. Good morning, sunshine, or afternoon, I should say. We are about to take off to go to Guanajuato. This is gonna be the second time we ride the ETN bus. Very luxurious. I was highly impressed the first time we rode it. But this time we're going downstairs. And downstairs you have no view of the front. And I tend to get car sick. So crossing my fingers that this is a good trip. We'll see. It is what it is. And I'm gonna make it work no matter what happens. I'm still crossing my fingers just in case. Street and we have to walk the rest of the way but it kind of works out because we get to see the neighborhood yeah it's far So Kiara made it up there <laughs> and turns out this is the wrong place. Okay, let's keep going. We ended up in Querétaro because a friend of mine was going to World's Good Summit, decided to get this extra huge house and invite us to join her. You can't say no to such a generous offer, so of course we said yes. Waking up in this Airbnb was truly magical. 
and I'll give you a tour later, but first... <laughs> I finally heard about the legend. Today we woke up with the intention of going to the supermarket so we can have food to eat for the whole week. Yet, my friend woke up with a headache after a whole day of travel and she needed something comforting, something that was familiar, something that when you ordered, you knew exactly what you were gonna get. Thus, we ended up here. And then, later on in the day, I had to come back because it was the only place I could find good Wi-Fi. There doesn't seem to be co-working spaces in Guanajuato. So here's the Starbucks where you order and then here's where you sit. And apparently there's no bathrooms, but I'll let you know later. You know, I feel like with travel, um, there's always something new, like everything's always changing, nothing is what you expect. And once in a while, it's kind of nice to just have that one thing that you know is a constant and um, Starbucks will do that. a lot of socializing to do with our friend that invited us um, so today um, it is the second day I have not used shampoo in my hair because the Airbnb didn't come with shampoo so I had to find a Soriana so I could take a decent shower <laughs> I, I feel like one of the biggest things that I've learned through travels is that showers are so important and and like sometimes hard to find I know when we were road tripping for the two years uh, we would go so many days without showers, or a proper shower at that. Um, so I am very grateful now for showers. So the Soriana was not far at all, so I'm glad I made it here. I had to take this with me. I usually cab it back, but because we're so close, it means I won't be able to film. <laughs> but you get the point. 